Good morning, ladies and ghouls. I came into the kitchen and I was going to make a pot of coffee, but <laughs> I don't have a coffee maker. So, uh, for at least today, I'm going to go out and grab a cup of coffee, try to wake up, and I'll see you guys on the other side of the intro. I need coffee. Coffee, 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 coffee. We're taking the other truck this morning because I got to drop off those barrels that are way back there. If you guys can see them way back there, I got to drop those back off at Precision Tune. I was actually supposed to have done that uh, a couple days ago, but it's not a huge important thing. How many of you have noticed that I've got a skeleton hanging in both of my trucks? Stopping by my old place of business. Watch this, are you ready? What up? <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> it's like a switch. <laughs> Thanks to Chris Perillo, and Vlogger Fair and Vlogger Day specifically, the first day that I went to, uh, the, it was the Vlogger Day. I know that didn't come out right, and I'm all blah, 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 blah. <laughs> the, the first day was Vlogger Day, and that was for everybody that vlogs. And we learned a lot of information with all the panels that they had. Um, it, it was like mind blowing um, because it's possible to sustain, sustain? Yes, not abstain. Okay. <laughs> Abstain. That's like when you get sweat on your abs and then you lean up against the wall and you get the sweat. Never mind. Okay, so anyway, um, if you guys have a YouTube channel and if you've got content on it and you want to see kind of like what you're worth, there's an awesome website out there called Social Blue Book. It just started here a few months ago and you can actually find out how much you are worth, meaning if you give like a, a product review or whatever. Um, it's basically how much you can ask from an advertise, advertiser to advertise their product, basically. So I'm doing that right now. And, and it's very interesting because I have had people um, say, hey, we've seen your channel and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, oh, you know, cool, thanks. And, and it never goes any further than that because I'm not a businessman. But I need to be. I need to be. And I know I'm talking really fast. That's because I'm really excited and there's a lot of crap going on right now. And I just want to take some time out to talk to you guys in the middle of the day to show you this. <sighs> Breathe. <sighs> Point of the matter is I'm about ready to submit my first quote to my first company. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. So maybe, maybe, fingers crossed, that if, if this type of stuff starts to work out, then maybe I won't have to do that stuff out there that gives me these nasty hands with grease on them that doesn't come out. Yeah. My hands are on crack, see? Crack. Once again, Troy's working hard on cars. And you guys hear the noise in the background? Do you see this? Yes, I'm working hard. So I certainly deserve an ice cream. And it's not our normal ice cream person, but you know something? They were here and the other guys weren't, so they lost out and I got ice cream, so I still win. Woo! <laughs> I actually got one for later too. It's my big vanilla. <laughs> I know. I'm goofy now. I don't know. I think that you guys are going to sense a change for the better. Okay, speaking of changing for the better, I have to fix this car so that it'll be better for the customer because that's what I do. I recorded it the other night. I'm actually sitting down and beginning to watch the spin off of The Walking Dead, Fear the Walking Dead, <laughs> so far. Not too impressed. Um, so if you guys watched it, then, oh my gosh, I'm dirty. Oh shoot, I'm really dirty. I'm so dirty, I didn't realize that. I got a shower. I didn't think I got, I got that dirty. Anyway, so if you guys have seen Fear the Walking Dead, then post it down in the comments of what you thought about it. Um, I don't think that I'm gonna do uh, <laughs> Fear the Vlogging Dead, uh, <laughs> but you know, you never can tell. Um, but like I said, it's just like the first scene so far, the, the first, uh, not the first clip, but the first, the intro. And yeah, it's like, okay, yeah. Been here, done that, yeah, there's zombies, so okay, what's next? Okay, so anyway, maybe my opinion will change, but I wanna finish watching it, and then I'm gonna shower, maybe not in that particular order. Yes, Fear the Walking Dead. All right, so second part, a little bit more interesting. So, it, but what I don't understand is they still don't show like exactly like from the point that it happened. So I'm not sure if that's something that this, I, I'm confused as to where this is going to go because this can only go on for so long as far as like when The Walking Dead 
picks it up, if that makes any sense. So I don't know. I don't know. If you guys have watched this, then again, let me know. And of course, it's been a half hour or so, and that was a long run until the first commercial, which means we're going to have like 10 minutes of commercials now. All right, guys, so I just uh, finished the end of Fear of the Walking Dead, and eh, it definitely got better. Um, I still don't see where it's going, though. I mean, because we all know where it's going, so I don't know. And so again, this is like the third time I've said this in like the last minute that you've been watching. Post it down in the comments before if you've seen it and what you thought of it. All right, and in fashion of, ooh, spooky, hold on. And in fashion, ha, 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 ha. That doesn't even sound, that doesn't sound spooky at all. I don't know why I said fashion either. Um, <laughs> I still haven't showered yet, okay? So I, yeah, God, I'm just freaking dirty. I just saw that. You guys see my scar? See, look at that. Isn't that cool? Didn't know that about me, did you? I cut my arm open one time, not on purpose, of course. Anyway, okay, the point. This room, this room right here, Phoenix's room, which this will be, um, I need to know what you guys think I should decorate it as. Now, he loves monster trucks, he likes dinosaurs, and I was thinking also of possibly something haunty. So, give me your guys' ideas. Gosh, I'm just like all over the place, I apologize. Squirrels, totally, I told you yesterday I couldn't concentrate on anything, and that's totally the truth. So, try to follow me. Try to follow, um, <laughs> if I can follow myself. Um, links, if you have links to like awesome, cheap, because you know, not made of money, uh, especially this time in my life, uh, things, give me your decoration ideas. This is a room, this is a palette that you have to work with. The curtains stay, the wall colors stay, and the floor stays. The floor needs to be refinished, but the floor stays. All right, so, okay, just, that little, that little tidbit right there. I just wanted to give you guys that, that tidbit. And now, now we're gonna do some cock. And the, for the new people that are watching, they're like, oh, did he say what I thought he said? Yeah, I did, because it's commenting on comments. So let's get into it from two days ago. I think that I just set the clip up. It, it's been a couple hours, guys. Um, I think I just set it up to do COC, but um, I stumbled upon some stuff that only a handful of you are gonna recognize. And you may not even recognize it. Um, Wow, this is just awesome. You guys remember this stuff? This, <laughs> this was the awesome stuff from the 1,000th subscriber party that we had at, um, at the Ram restaurant. That was so awesome. So we got all these little skulls and, and black autumn leaves and just all this like awesomeness in here all these spiders over here Arr. anyway okay so now it's time for cock because the video is going to be all long now and everything and we have three days of cock to get through so let's do it so this coc is for 822 day 1756 vlogger fair day two two seattle 2015 jason christopher 77 haha <laughs> you're such a dude the first thing you get is a microwave well yeah you gotta cook stuff dark legion 75 have you tried that s'mores flavored candy corn i've seen lately at the store yes i have and i will not buy any because if i do it will be gone in a matter of minutes candy corn and me is is i mean i love it but it's also it i eat it quick susan martin been a youtuber watcher for a while i just don't ever comment fell in love with you and your videos for the longest Loved your family, but with them or without them, I'll still be a fan. Happy haunting, Troy. Keep on smiling. <laughs> see, I told you. You guys never cease to amaze me. It's just so awesome. And I also want to thank everybody that kind of spurred me on to go to Vlogger Fair because since Vlogger Fair, um, we've had a really good uprise in the channel. I, I guess that's what you want to say. Or I guess that's what I said. Whatever. The Energized. Um... Such a hectic and tiring couple of days, not to forget awesome too. I'm impressed that you didn't forget to add the outro. <laughs> I know, right? Adam Scapulatumpor. <laughs> I think I said it right again. I think I say it differently every time. Um, what, is that a real last name? Is that your real last name? Just wondering, or is that just something you made up? Um, what is your favorite part of Vlogger Fair 2015? Um, quite honestly, my favorite part was uh, Oh, I okay well there's lots of different parts um, making the friends that I made that was like really really cool I think that was my favorite part and and networking with people and and learning new stuff that I didn't know before 
um, rubbing elbows with with you know famous YouTubers and the reason why I say famous is because we're all just the same we do this of course uh, meeting Ali and Charles and um, Shay Carl and uh, Judy and everybody else it was just it was just so cool we're moving on to 82315 day 1757 Lowe's Halloween stuff in HD this was the same vlog where I told you guys about personal information and that uh, I'm unfortunately not doing a haunt this year um, oh my gosh 56 comments you guys are so awesome oh my gosh that's crazy because yelling just makes it that much more apparent that it's crazy. Wow, Jimmy said something, and I, I, I want, I've been meaning to touch on this. Troy, I think you should take a break from the logs, from the logs, from the vlogs a little bit. Take some time off and just relax. And I believe I'm speaking on behalf of everyone here. You don't have to plaster on a fake smile every day if you aren't feeling your best. Um, quite honestly, I don't, I don't do a fake smile really. I, I try not to do anything fake for the vlogs because you guys can see right through it. I mean, you guys have seen that, you know, I've been stressed, um, you know, I'm not going to go into anything else. I will say that if you have done something for 1700 days in a row, you are not going to take a break. <laughs> I'm not taking a break. I enjoy doing this. Um, it is fun. And uh, after I get through some some like stuff going on here, I'm going to concentrate on finding um, finding and scheduling Halloween events to do. Joyable Mom 9 not going to lie, my heart hurt a little when you said no haunt this year. Man, I I almost shed a tear about it. Honestly, it yeah, it, uh, it sucks, but it has happened. Or it has to not happen. New commenter, I believe, Cal Aureth. Uh, this year you can go out and enjoy Halloween and see all the cool haunts out there. Um, yes, uh, that's that's the plan. Uh, because, you know, when I do my haunt, I don't get to go out and see other people's haunts. So yeah, this year I'm going to make it a point to try and possibly even go see Ram's haunt across the state. As long as the state isn't <laughs> still on fire at that time. I really sincerely appreciate everybody's kind words of encouragement. This is going to morning, take guys. so long it's to edit. Day. Finally catching up on the last day of cock. This is yesterday, 1758. Good hauntiness, or goodwill hauntiness rather. I'm talking about haunts at the Goodwill store. Nicole Mitchell, I haven't commented in a while, but I've been watching. Much love to you, Troy. Well, thank you. And you also say, the last few vlog numbers are out of whack. Just thought I'd bring it to your attention. Thank you so much, and because of that, I did go back and correct them, and I love it when you guys do that, because me and my OCD, I'm surprised I didn't catch it to begin with, but, you know, sometimes when that happens, it's just cool for that you guys catch it, so I can fix it. 9433, I hope that you saw my picture on Facebook of my prize. I finally got Happy Haunting. Yes, and there's, I'm glad that you finally got it. And there is one more person that I need to make sure gets their prize for the contest that we had a long time ago. Um... And I don't think that I'm going to do a, a contest that epic again because it was really, really difficult to make sure that everybody got everything that they were supposed to get when they were supposed to get it and to coordinate with all the winners and all of the suppliers. And it was, it was, it was a chore. I'll tell you, it was a chore. Wow, Jimmy, Troy, please read. You said that you would be decorating the lawn for Halloween and I have an idea. What you can do is just make a little walkway for the trick-or-treaters under your carport with creepy lighting, some decorations, and other stuff you already own. It's just a little spooky little path to get to your front door. Just an idea. Happy haunting. Yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably, you guys know me, I'll probably end up doing something. Um, but the carport, um, I have to kind of reserve for, to make sure that I can still work on cars. Because as much as it's going to rain and everything this winter, um, I really don't want to be out rolling around in mud. I'm not a pig. And it'd be cold. I'd be a cold pig. This made me laugh. Uh, Jason Christopher 77 as a graveyard guy I have a pretty good grasp on what is early and what is late it's late when you go to bed late even if it's early and it's early when you wake up early even if you wake up late by going to bed early it's not as early as it would be being late I'm surprised I made it through that without stumbling and he said what the f did I just say squirrel yeah well no it's true and and I followed that really well 
<laughs> Stacy Reigns. Yes, we are your cheerleaders. Go, Troy! Screaming, Scott. Welcome back, dude. It's been a while. Um, I'll be a cheerleader, but I'm not wearing the outfit. Oh, why not? <laughs> uh, Nick Campos. Uh, just got caught up. Heard you're wearing all the hats when it comes to your auto tech business. I'd be willing to help you out with any web slash logo design needs as well as social media marketing. We need to talk because yes, please. Oh my gosh. And not in a bad way either. You know, like when somebody says, we need to talk. No, it's not like that. Marie Winton, it was awesome meeting you at Vlog Affair. I'm a big horror and Halloween fan, so I am super excited about your channel. I'm the one who does gothic beagle dark fashion for your pets here in portland oregon i apologize that i never vlogged it and this is so cool guys because this reminds me of popcorn this really really does look it looks like popcorn it's so cute but anyway yeah she makes a, a clothing line come on focus 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 <laughs> oh my gosh it focused for a second yes yes Okay, it focused for a second. I'll probably still frame that. Um, but yeah, that's really cool. So thank you. Okay, so the battery died uh, when I was doing COC and I didn't realize it. So, okay, so last two comments. Amy Gibson, try Big Lots for furniture. They have great prices. Really missing Phoenix in the vlog. Thank you. And me too. Angie Palmer, hi Troy, I miss you so much, computer problems happened, I stayed up half the night and watched every vlog since it broke, the 18th through today. Talk about having home off withdrawals, I was one eye twitch away from becoming a mad woman. Glad to be back, and I want to say that you put yourself out there, not many people have the strength to do that, and you have class and decency. Thank you for that, thumbs up and happy haunting, thumbs up to you, happy haunting to you, happy haunting to everybody, going to bed now. Well, after I edit this. And then, um, yeah, wh whatever happens tomorrow, happens tomorrow. Duh. Of course. Okay. Oh, my God. Happy hunting, guys. See you tomorrow.